yeah, yeah, yeah. When we in the windy city, you know we gon' bear down. Whole team step out on the field, ain't no playing around. Home of the Bulls in the socks. Bet my defense put you in the box. When you see us out there on the field, we be flying high like the Black Hawk. You be y'all talk, we be y'all walk. Look how we bringing this pressure. Now you out here trying to throw a Hail Mary, taking them desperate measures. This is Shot Town, this is my town. TD bringing heat, don't cry now. Windy City, yeah, it's a new day. About to bring the trophy home like MJ. Look at the screen you guys saw it happen last time, Justin Fields. I try and get these, keep killing like one, 10,000 likes. I'm trying to get these to you guys as soon as humanly possible. I probably, it's an online franchise, but the fast food 10,000 likes, I'm, like I said, I'm doing my best. Thank you all so much for all the love and support in this series. I, every time I post this series or I go to post this series, I just smile. I honestly, like, I can truly just tell you guys from the bottom of my heart, I have more fun with this than anything. So I think it's so cool. I do have a comment question and I want as many people as possible to answer. We're now almost three years in. Who's your guys' favorite storyline? Um, there's lots to choose from. There's Teddy Freeman. There's Mooney. There's Khalil Herbert. Obviously, the Justin Fields character arc, I think, is becoming probably my favorite. Jalen Johnson's always good. I Let me know who your guys' favorite like story on the team is. It's cool that Khalil Herbert, but I think the Justin Fields, like, three years of just, like, I suck. I can't figure it out. Interceptions, almost getting rid of him. Drafting his replacement having his other replacement on the roster, and then him just having an MVP season. I think that's my favorite storyline. Comment down below. Guys, we have quite the week um, coming up here. Essentially, three games against three very, 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 very tough opponents. Um, week 16, week 17, and week 18, as you guys can see. Um, all tough. Green Bay I have yet to beat this year. Um, just being brutally honest, Washington was in the Super Bowl last year and then Green Bay again. This video is going to be our biggest test of the season and we got to go 3 and up. So let's just, we got to focus up. We're going to talk about things. We're a different player than we were last year. And I know that. You guys know that if you're watching. I know there's things that we can do now that we were not doing last year. We have different weapons. We have different, we're just different in a lot of ways, in a lot of very, oh, Marcus Davenport gets an upgrade. Um, there was a force win. The Vikings guy was not there. Um, it's usually, like I said, the, the time I played it before there wasn't a force win. should have just been a force win. Orlando Brown gets an upgrade. I'm going to go pass protector with Orlando. I'm still very happy with that. Like, that was our first year. I don't know if you guys remember. Our first year, I spent a lot of money on my tackles. I didn't really look for anything else other than tackles. It was something that was really, really, really important to me. Um, hmm... Let's just go zone. Dang, I don't. It's hard to know what to do with Brisker. We're playing with a lot of good morale right now, though. Let me just. Let me, I'll be the first one to say we got some good morale. Gene Lewis, such a great season. Um, so happy that I got this guy. Honestly, just a great draft pick. Believe he was a second round, um, second round guy. Devin White, another guy, free agency. Just I paid him a lot of money despite not being a superstar, and we've seen great production from Devin White. All year, it's just been like 14 TFLs and six sacks with 64. It's exactly what you expect when you bring in a guy like Devin White. You know he's a tackling machine, not really looked at by a lot of people for the main reason of just the fact that he doesn't have a superstar abilities. So people didn't want to pay him a lot of money. I looked at him as like, how do I not pay this guy a lot of money um, with just how good I know he can be? As of right now, the playoff picture, we are the number one seed. Um, the number two seed is the Saints. I don't know how many losses the Saints has, but we do have a relatively decent kind of lead, I think. I'm going to look at the standings real quick to see how far back the Saints are. Saints have two losses and the Commanders have two losses. So guys, these are big weeks. We could easily slip, but I want to keep this. I want to keep this number one seed. I want to keep everything just square as it is. We're having a great year. Um, Justin Fields, this is his first game with the Billies. We do have this trade um, that I sent. TSAP, he... I sent the trade to TSAP. I don't know if TSAP's having cold feet or what over there, but I sent the trade. Justin Fields, as you can see, I'm gonna he, tight out, approved of boom and catching all tight ends who are open on pass plays, and then bulldozer. I don't really like that closer. Pass ability really improved the catching and prowess of all running backs who are open on pass plays. I kind of like that. I don't. I want something passing wise. No look did I? Perfect action on all crossbody throws up to 20 yards. Let's do no look. That actually seems like kind of a fire ability. So. 
First Justin Fields game going up against the Packers. You know what you're getting. I'm just waiting on this guy to lose Aaron Rodgers because he will be nothing without him. Michael Thomas, Christian Watson, Romeo Dubs, and then a superstar tight end and a great secondary. Um, yeah, guys. Be great, fellas. Let's go. On second down at four. Rodgers. He's gonna Don't do it. For Watson. Here's Rodgers to throw. Off to Thomas on the left side. Hmm. Good play. Good play, good play, good play. Okay, that was a bad drive, man. That was a bad drive. Fields now to throw. That's complete to his running back, Herbert. First down. Here's Fields. Lays. He's got Freeman here. It's good job, Teddy. And he will have mm. the Bears first down as they're able to get the third down. I got to run plays that don't require audibles because you can't audible against this. This is just so dumb. It's Fields. Go up, St. Brown. Good job, St. Brown. On third down, Herbert. He got it, doesn't he? And here we go on fourth down, Fields. And it's incomplete. Should have ran. Oh my gosh, I play horrible against this guy. From the 38, Rodgers. Book. Bang! Come on! This guy's not good, Brett. He's not freaking good. Stop treating him like he's good. Now it's Fields. Got him. Up top, Moody. You can't guard that. Get him out of that defense. Okay, if you're asking, I will take three here. Hmm. Take three. Dang it, dude. I got to find a way to make these touchdowns. I don't know why the field goal thing's like that. I don't know if that means the difficulty's weird or what, but I have no idea why the field goal marker looks like that. Yo, we got to play that, Dory. Now a first down carry by Jones. And he's got it across mid nine and five now on the year. Well, they were winners their last time out. So Come here. Come here. Oh, my. Get up, Moore. Oh, my gosh. He's got to get up there. You're going to cost your team chances. Go, Khalil. Oh, my gosh, Khalil. Give him the ball. I don't know if you need to. What else do I need to say? Give that man the ball. As the offense comes out here, Charles, remember they threw the interception last time out, but they were moving the football down the field. Dang, that's a good run. Have a sustained drive. On second and ten, Rodgers. Yeah, that's Jalen Johnson. Oh, my He's gosh. He's got the hook up with Dobbs. Bro, it's not a good read. Rodgers going to throw. Dang. I don't know why I didn't expect that. Packers touchdown. Oh, okay, hey, like I said, defense didn't look bad there. Pressure came in. He threw it at Jalen Johnson. You take your chances. When someone throws it at Jalen Johnson, usually, usually you're going to be able to have a little bit of success, but not that time. A play fake now fields to throw. Escaping the pressure right. Now he's going to throw deep right. Got him. Let's go. Come on! Come here, come here, Aaron. To throw, it's Rodgers. That is held in by Michael Thomas. And way up past the 35 before he's taken down. Throwing on first down is Rodgers. Open man left side, it's a tight end. Here's Rodgers. Another one. Whoa, what? My dude glitched. Play this. I think we'll find out just how much they trust their guys in this situation if they decide to drop it in there, but it's intercepted. Picked up by Jair. That was done. So after the INT, it's Rodgers. 
That's taken in by Watson. Oh gosh. The kick by Bass is good. And that one. Off play action. Fields. Come on, St. Brown. Good job. Get up field, St. Brown. Okay. It's a big bounce back, guys. Second and ten. Fields again. Come on, Lewis. It's a short one here. Good job, Lewis. Well done, Lewis. So this, is, this, this is just a huge drive for so many reasons. This is a big drive. There's lots of room right there. Good job, Khalil. Well done, Khalil. They'll fake the handoff. Now Fields. And that'll be caught. It's St. Brown. Again, Fields. Okay. Laser. Let's go! Come on. Oh, okay, we fight, fellas. Tooth and nail. Every play, we fight. Gotta get a stop, though. Yeah, you're good, Justin. That's a first, right? 30 inches. Here's Fields. Nice catch, Moody. Nice catch. Oh my gosh, Herbert. Good run, Khalil Herbert. I guess I could clock this. Now it's Fields. Hate the play call, bro. Hate the play call. Take off on it, and that may have been what happened there. And he'll be taken. We're gonna call timeout. Run the football. We got control of this. Dude, I ran commit. No time to shine. Oh my gosh, I ran commit right there. GG's man. Oh gosh, the curse continues, dude. At this point, it's a curse. Like I said, Bryce has never, I kid you not, Bryce has never beat me in any other league. Bryce has never won a Super Bowl. He's never even done decent in these leagues. I'm just, he's got my number, man. Oh, we get to play him again in two weeks. Bad game in general. Made too many mistakes. Um, just didn't play well. We got to, hey. In general, we just got to be a lot better than that. That's our worst game of the season by far, it's just in terms of executing and every single word there is. Um, yeah, dude, we got we got to figure it out. Like I said, he's gonna be someone we could potentially see in the playoffs, and I can't afford to lose these last three games. So I got to go beat Washington now. Uh, this Washington game just got a whole lot more important because I got to beat Washington because he also has only two losses. So this is a 10 out of 10. Boom! Calvin Beckham gets a speed upgrade. This is a 10 out of 10 importance game against Washington next week. I don't know why I have a QB breakout thing on the screen. I don't know why I have a QB breakout thing on the screen. Like I said, this game is so glitched. It's it's so weird, but uh, head up. Mm, okay, we fight. We'll see you guys against Washington. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, boom, look at the screen. I, I got a rant. Um, this sucks for the league, this sucks for the series, and, and I'm incredibly upset about it. And I'm, I'm frustrated with this game, and I'm frustrated with franchise mode. Essentially, right after the game, um, well, obviously not right after, you guys saw me go to the main menu, probably five or ten minutes later, um, our stats just randomly got deleted. So, stats from the game no longer showed up. Then, the commish literally went, earn, and we asked, Bryce, I said, Bryce gets the force win, Bryce gets the force win. He said the force win for Bryce, who was the guy that I played. He also said the force win for the Chiefs and the Chargers and one other guy. All those force wins did not register. And I know you guys can look at me right now and say, TD, all oh, blah, 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 blah. Look, it was literally a force win. Why would I cheat in this situation? This just messes up the entire league. If against the Packers in our next game, even if I win, I have to take the loss and it's just gonna mess with stats. There's a few people that's messing with their playoffs. So if the Chiefs and stuff miss the playoffs, it just ruins everything. It ruins the series, it ruins every, I'm just angry because I should be 14 and one right now. I, I already lost my undefeated season, but now I can't just have fun and play these last two games. Now we gotta wor worry about make rights and doing all this stuff. 
I'm annoyed. It sucks. If you don't believe me, you don't have to believe me. I've done franchises for how long? How many times have you guys ever seen this happen? You literally saw us exit the game with me losing and then all of a sudden I win. And the stats from games just don't save. It's really, really, really annoying. I apologize. It sucks. It's stupid. I literally get bailed out and it makes me even look horrible with Justin Fields. I'm mad. I don't say this very often, but I'm really, really frustrated with how glitchy this mode is. A mode that I love. I'm frustrated that stats get deleted. I'm frustrated that we still all this stuff that goes on. I'm frustrated that Justin Fields just randomly loses his superstar. But okay, so how we're gonna like solve this? I don't even know like how we're gonna. It's it's literally so the Packers. It affects his playoffs. So now like if he for somehow misses the playoffs, I'm just gonna pay him. I'll give him prize pool money because he just got absolutely cheated out of his mind. Obviously, the Packers next week's the easiest make right because if I lose that game or if I win that game, I can just give him the loss. If he wins and beats me again, it's just going to be a complete disaster. I apologize. I'm annoyed. I'm just I'm frustrated. And I'm, but I'm going to try and have fun for the remainder of this video. Uh, Khalil Herbert gets an upgrade, um, which, which is fun. I'm, I'm going to try and enjoy this. La this last two games. I'm so excited. Like I said, I'm pretty sure. Didn't I already upgrade Mooney? Like, did you guys not watch me upgrade Mooney? Are we doing the same upgrades twice? I, I'm certain I just upgraded Mooney. And Beckham, check this out. I literally just updated Beckham. He got 95 speed. Now I'm updating Beckham again, and he's back to 94. You just saw him get 95 speed. Oh my gosh, nothing saves, nothing's working, and it's just driving me absolutely crazy. I'll upgrade Playmaker again, but like I said, everything just resets every single week. We're gonna try and figure this out. Like I said, the real person who got absolutely screwed over was the Packers. He played great, and now he's got a loss, and we gotta figure out what we're gonna do. I'm gonna try not to just yell and scream right now and enjoy the rest of the video, but that was my rant. I'm done with my rant. I'm not talking about it. If people say or ask in the comments why, if you watch this part of the video, please explain to them um, why I didn't get a loss for that because I know there's going to be a lot of confusion. Okay, as far as people that I want to sign, um, Tredavious Moore is one of them. I'm going to offer him a somewhat player friendly, $3 million a year. Um, I like Tredavious Moore. I want him to come back. Also, Chris Wilcox, he's a good player over two years. I think he's probably going to accept this. Not negotiating the years. Up it or move on. Dang. Okay. Chris Wilco For a 26-year-old, dang. He's got a lot of player friendly. I, I think player friendly is good. Dang. Okay. No, I got to start paying some of these dudes. Especially Jones. Because Jones, I literally thought, I, I'm pretty sure me, I don't mean to say, I'm pretty sure me and T7 completed that trade and now he's back on my team. I don't even know where to begin right now. Um, okay. Washington. Made it to the Super Bowl last year. Um, obviously a great team. Great team. Tough out. Like Sam Howell, like, or no, he runs Malik Willis at QB. They traded. The Titans guy signed Brady and then traded for him. Um, two superstar receivers. A really, really, really good 6'5 tight end. Um, DBs are tough. He's got Kendall Fuller. He's got two superstar DBs. I believe both with inside. Um yeah, both with inside shade. He's got the best defense in the league, and it's not remotely close. Um, pretty sure unless he lost some of them. Yeah, he's got him. Montez lost his ability, and he's got Chase Young. Guys, he's a tough out. Made it to the Super Bowl last year. Let's just go have fun and win a game. I don't want to worry about the league glitching anymore. Yes, I'm upset about it, but let's just go win. I always struggle with this guy's offense. It's always something completely out of the ordinary and strange. Willis going to throw it right away. Yeah, like, it's weird. Oh, his offense. I think the best thing to do against this is get a curl flat on one side, but just blitz the league against him because it does not take much to blitz him. Come here. Like, all, all you have to do against five wide, some people will still send stock spinner against five wide, but that's really not necessary because in order for Spinner to come in against five wide, it only takes one person. So it's like, you don't really necessarily need that. I got a 10 yard right there. Boom. Come here! Come here, go! Go, Chris! Let's go, defense! Statement game. Come on. 
Let's go! Go, Gene! Go, Gene! Good throw. He's trying to blitz us like crazy, man. Got him. Please! Good job, Mooney! That's the Mooney we know. Now Willis on third down. It's a short one here. Complete to the tie. All the way to gain of six. Now Willis on first. That's a book. And he's got his big tight end here. Third down, it's Willis. And he finds McClellan. And the Third and goal, Willis. Shoot, good play. Hesitated. Oh, gosh. Okay, this is a... I'm thinking cover four is kind of the best. But it's hard to know. Okay, he missed the extra point. I think I got him. Yeah, I do. Teddy, Teddy, go! Good job, Teddy. Good switch up. And just banked on him not realizing that I switched anyone's side. And it kind of paid off, if I'm being honest. They'll fake the handoff, now Fields. Back-to-back -back completion. Should have field Freeman. Good job, Freeman. Lays. Laser! Let's go! You cannot throw a better ball than that. Yeah, got him! Stop trying to egg me, dude. We get it. We get it. You watch Ultimate Team. We get it. We get it, Miles. Yep. Money. Oh, Mooney. Come on, man. Okay. Good stuff. Okay, up two scores. We get ball at half. Hey, we're playing great football right now against a very, very, very good opponent. So, don't jinx it. Stay smart. Stay doing exactly what we're doing. Good job. Do that stupid play. I got somebody waiting for it. No. Nope. He's short. Or a yard short. Okay, play this first. Switch to that. Do the QB draw. I freaking dare you, man. Do it. Do it. Do it. What did I say? Do the QB draw. Okay, we don't want to do anything stupid here. He's, I, he's notoriously got one of the best defenses in the league. Good job, Khalil. Oh, my gosh. Yeah, thank you. Okay, we're going on conservative. We got to be smart. I'll take three here if it's the case. But I, don't, I don't think it will be, but yeah. Yo, look at Khalil just fighting for his life. Walk in. Let's go. Okay. 28-6, man. 28-6. Let's go. I just don't... I don't get it. Stop testing Johnson. Like, this is... I, I'm... He's on him for a reason. That's, that's the best case scenario. Take 40 seconds. Okay, we'll sit here for 40. They may be forced to try and get something out of this drive. Oh, Jalen, I gotta outside shade him. I think he is. I think he's just gonna press one. Teddy again. And Teddy's gonna go up top all day, baby. Go, Freeman! Stop it! Let's go, man! I keep switching them. Every, like, I'll do like six plays with Freeman on the right. And then I'll randomly switch them to confuse them. And clearly it's working. In the second half, they have to do what precious few teams have done in NFL history. Let's try to come back from a four possession deficit. Oh my gosh. And partner, you know, as that team gathers. Good play. That's all right. From the midfield stripe, they'll look to throw. And that will be it. Fourth down, Willis. Uh, he's got this to the third. Willis looks to pass it here. Dude, I... What? Down Washington. Tell me I didn't read that. Yeah, that, that's beautiful. Go, Khalil Herbert. Good hit. First and ten, Willis. He'll get this complete to Rondale Moore. 
You just gotta earn it. Come here. I'm sick of it, bro. I, I don't wanna see that anymore. Miles smiles. I don't wanna see that junk anymore on my field, bro. Baiting that all game finally got him to throw it. Oh, okay, good stuff. Good game, Miles. Oh, gosh. Okay, hey, that's how you play it, man. That, my friends, I'm not going to look at any stats. I'm not going to look at any. Hopefully, no guarantee that these stats will even save. I won't look at them after the game. Just exit. We're not even going to look at anything. We're not going to do any upgrades. We're not even going to think. Um, sack the QB five times. We, we did that. We played really, really, really good. Um, 55 to 27, like I said. I'm going to give this until we start the next uh, week before I even touch anything because I want this game to save. And apparently if you just leave it and don't do anything, you have your best chance. So I'll see you guys week 18 against the Packers. We're playing that game, but if I lose, I lose either way. But I think with that win, um, I think my I think I'm potentially, yeah. Ladies and gentlemen, hey, look at you're looking at the one seed. Boom, let's go. This way, no one can even complain because of the fact that even if I would have got that other loss, I still would be 16 and two. Um, or I would be 15 and two, which is better than what the commanders will be. The Giants will be. Guys, we just secured the number one seed. <laughs> Boom, let's go. See you guys against the Packers. Boom, bam, fellas. Okay, week 18, like I said, no matter what, I'm taking the loss in this game at the end. Uh, but if I actually were to lose, it messes with a bunch of things. So, guys, we're playing this. Obviously, we're going to play this game. This game has a lot, and just hashtag it down below. Hashtag, let's just win. I, I can't lose to this guy anymore. Um, there comes a point when you just got to shut up and figure things out. He's just been in my head. Not really, though. But, like, I just don't... I honestly don't think he's that good. Teddy Freeman gets an upgrade. And I know that's insulting. But I, I really, really feel like I just consistently underperform. Gene Lewis gets an upgrade, which is beautiful. But it would just go a long way if I just could go and just beat him, man. Also, it just goes a long way for everything. Like I said, the stats from this probably aren't going to really matter. Yada, yada, yada. It's all going to be a mess. Um, Jalen Johnson gets an upgrade to a 95 overall, which is beautiful. Plus one man coverage. I'm going to get the loss anyways, but just for our confidence. We want to go in here. We're at home. He gets to come to Chicago and we get to try and finally, finally beat this guy. Um, somehow, freaking Tanner McKee. Tanner McKee. You already know. Is the MVP. 54 touchdowns, nine interceptions, a better record, and I moved around better. I see, okay, who do you guys give MVP to? I see why you give it to Tanner McKee. 68 touchdowns, yeah, he's good, don't get me wrong. Tanner McKee's a good player, but I just think the field story and the fact that even despite this like loss and all the junk that just went on, I think we had a better record. So that's I think why I think that we deserve it, but is what it is, guys. I don't care about anybody's feelings. I don't care about nothing. I want to win this game, um, but I will lose it statistically, but I want to win it mentally. So let's go get a dub. Fields passing on the first play go Khalil. Oh my gosh, Khalil. Oh my goodness, Khalil. Dance with him. Now it's Fields. That's complete to his running back, Herbert. There we go. And they'll get him first down. Fields throwing again. There we go, Freeman, good throw. Khalil Herbert, close to a first. I think he's gonna think I'm throwing a wheel, not running. Yeah, he did. Boom, let's go. Good drive, good drive, good drive. They'll come out throwing here to start the drive. That is good throw. Throwing is Rogers. He'll go right back to tell you. And he's going to be tapped. On second and nine. Rodgers. Throw that. Come on. Throw it. Now on third and long, they'll look to throw. That's caught inside the 20. Rodgers with a give. It's Aaron Jones. And he will get this into the end. To throw his fields. Let's go, Gene. Well done, Gene Lewis. I gotta say, if it's gonna be this cold, I want snow. 
Good job. Good job, Quentin. Throwing again is Fields. Let's go. That's Justin Fields for you. Come on. Here's Fields. I never run that play. I never run stock flood. I don't know why I just did. Rogers now to throw. Okay, fight, Brett. Control. Let's see if they can get things back on track. And this is where the coach is walking that Good catch, Mooney. Good catch. They snap it to Fields. Good job, Gene. Good job, Gene Lewis. This one looks good. It is good. Rubbing for them in the locker room at halftime. And he's taken down, but from the 39, Rogers steps away to his left. That is hauled in by Michael. Now Rogers. Pass complete. Finds. Now it's Rogers. <laughs> That's not even a. I don't even think that was the road he was on. Shotgun now for Rogers. That's bagged. Okay, take three. Stay in it, Brett. Hey, we did a good job right there. He's the type he's gonna take three. Okay, we gotta get seven though. We gotta find a way, dude. He hasn't scored a ton this game. I've made a lot of mental mistakes. I need a quick seven here. Get back into it. I kind of know the adjustments that he's doing, so I, I got to figure it out. Safety that way. Should be a Teddy Freeman freebie. Yeah, and it is. Go, Teddy! Go, Teddy! Come on! Let's go! He's been putting that every time he plays too many, he puts that safety down. I'm throwing that every single time. I got the fastest receiver on in the planet right now. And I'm just going to throw it to him and trust him. Pass lead inside. Beauty. Okay, one stop, guys. I haven't even played good, and we're in this game. Like, okay, this is like the luckiest player in the world. I got nothing. Like... Throwing his Rodgers on third down. Okay, thank goodness. They'll go for it. It's Rodgers. Bot, let's go. Come on, go home, Antonio. Okay, should have been a pick before. One more stop, defense. One more stop. Rodgers going to throw. Out of the backfield, this is Aaron Jones. And they're able from the shotgun to give to Jones. Come on, Dory. Ah, good job, Dory. Rodgers now on first down. So not a rank right there. Fields now to throw. Dot! Dot! Let's go! Good job, Gene. Is he a little bit dinged up here? Or is it just off just by a bit? Gene Lewis! Oh my gosh. He's achieved that in this performance. Here we go on fourth down, Fields, and it's going to be Rodgers to throw to Dobbs, and he holds it in, and he is out of bounds with the back to throw, Rodgers, man open, here is Jones, and that's a touchdown. Okay, well I had to lose anyways, but, oh my gosh. Good try, Quentin. GG's, man. Like I said, this actually works out in some ways because we did have to lose this game. Um, we played well. We played good defensively. It was the knockout, dude. He had a good play on that fourth and inches, bro. He had a good play. Dang it. Okay, so season ending, we actually realistically end 15-2. and two. Um, 
So 15 wins, two losses, both to the exact same person, um, same guy, freaking Bryce. Um, but overall, I can't be happier with this season. Guys, please kill like button. It's playoffs. Honestly, straight up, I would not be shocked. First round, we're going to get him again. I would not be shocked. He's going to come in as this number seven seed. And first round, we're going to get him again. Like, you can't write this stuff. Um, <sighs> kill a like button, man. Eventually, we're going to get our dub against him. And when we do, we can. I know we can make the Super Bowl. But, like, that game, I was like, eh. I feel like I kind of... In some ways, I would have definitely played that final little bit different if I knew that I didn't actually have to lose. And I, I'm not even just saying that as a loser. I know that I would have played that potentially a little bit different. I probably would have ran the ball. But either way, guys, GG's. 10,000 likes for the next one. 16-1. Good season. <sighs> See you guys in the playoffs. Thank you guys so much for watching. I have a second channel where I post hockey gameplay. Please go subscribe. The nicest thing you did to me, just go check out that channel. Leave a like. Even if you don't like hockey, give it a chance. Subscribe to the channel. Uh, my Instagram is at BrettBQB. My Twitter is TDBearYG. I am a part of Top Dog Madden. You can get all the best tips at topdogmadden.com for your ebooks, all those type of things. Thank you guys so much for watching. Kill the like button again. If you haven't killed the like button on this video, do it. And once again, go check out my hockey.